Hello YouTube, it's Lynn from WA. I'm at the South Eastern Orchid Society show, which is on this weekend, and <laughs> I just thought I'd show you the Australasian Native Orchid Society of WA. I'll show you their display because these are Australian natives and I know a lot of you like the Australian Dendrobium. So we'll, we'll just go around and we'll look at some names, we'll look at some colours and the only thing I can't impart to you is the perfume of these beautiful, beautiful flowers. They are so strong. In fact, you can only stay around this area for a certain length of time because they are so strong. So these are speciosum and actually a lot deeper colour than they look in the film, in the, in the picture. So let's go down to this label because I can't get it out of the pot. So this is speciosum. Bevan by George River Special by Daylight Moon. And this one, it really is quite a deep yellow. It's beautiful. Then we have a white one here. Let me just turn it around so I can see the label. I really shouldn't be touching the display at all. And if they see me, I'm going to get in trouble. Okay, so this is looks like Dr. Waringa White, I don't know if that says small or snail, and I do have my glasses on, <laughs> snail I think. So that's a, a nice white, you can only see the back of it really. And this is a paler one, it's coming out more white, but it's actually just a very pale yellow. And here we've got a bit of a mixture of colours. So we've got a purple with green in the centre. This, this is actually green. Where's my finger? This is actually green here. Uh, it's not white as it's coming out. And then you've got that very pale lip with that purple stripe coming down. And that's down here. Let's have a look at this label. Okay, Dendrobium Awesome by Speciosum Daylight Moon. So that's a hybrid, and it's a lovely hybrid. And you can see how strong these pseudobulbs really are. They're beautiful. And here we've got one with some yellow and purple. And again, that sort of purple lip and that purple stripe that goes down the labellum. And this one's from Cedardale Orchids, which I presume is in Queensland. Yes, that's from Queensland. And this is called, oh, Pee Wee Keith by Sun Glow. There you go, little Pee Wee. And here we've got just a mauvey one. Now, I can't see the label for that one. Oh, here it is down here. It's a bit hard filming with an iPad. I've, my phone battery is almost dead, so I can't use my phone. Let's have a look. Here we go. This is. I'm going to have to read it. Esme Porton by Speciosum Windermere, which is a very famous Speciosum, highly awarded. So that's a lovely cross lovely colours. Oh, and look at this tiny little thing. Really delicate little flowers. I don't know, I'm going to try and move this spike up towards the next one so you can see the difference in the size. That truly is beautiful. It's pure white. It's got the tiniest, tiniest of purple spots and that just that yellow splash in the labellum. That really is delightful. Uh, it looks like it might be called Fluffy. With the inner tick. Oh yes, some really, really pretty ones. There's a nice white one at the back there with a purple lip. Lots of yellows, the speciosums. They, they feel that the yellows are much more 
valuable than the white. They're, they're less common, so the guys try and breed these beautiful dark yellow. And this is awesome red pat. And it's in brackets lustrous by speciosum. So another hybrid, and that's a really deep colour. It's like a dark red. Really nice. It sits up quite proud. Ah, and here's another little one. Look at this. Little tiny thing. Oh, that is so cute. That is really, really pretty. See if I can find. I might have to go around the back to find the name on that one. Or oh, here's another pretty one. A yellow with uh, a nice purple labellum. And that label is handy, so let's have a look. Elegant Heart Tropic Splendor. Really pretty. Really, really pretty. And this one looks like a little Kingianum. I bet it is. Let's have a look. Yes, Kingianum Betty. A very dark flower. And this one is quite fluffy. It's very, 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 very thin flowers, very skinny, so it almost looks fluffy. Um, <laughs> have a look at the root system one. Oh, it's actually mounted. So I can't find the label, but that's a fantastic mount. Fantastic. I've seen that one before. I'm going to go around the back to try and find the name of that plant. These are the guys from ANOS, <laughs> president and a member. It's a very small club, but boy, do they do some great work. Okay, so here's that little ditty yellow one that I was talking about. There's its flower and its name. Okay, it's Gracilicorva howianum by Speciosum, Red Factor by Red Spot. So there it is. Red, well, it's only a minor red spot, a mini, mini red spot. No, it's not. I can't see a red spot. But absolutely beautiful. The smell is overpowering. I'm going to have to get away from here because it's just, oh, it's intoxicating. Okay, there you go. That's the Aust Australasian Native Orchid Society with our native Australian orchids. I hope you enjoyed this. And if you're lucky, you might get something else. I might go and do the grand champion table a bit later. Bye.